Gregory. There's another animatronic here. But he looks broken down. <laughs> You're right. Something is written on his foot. I think it says, Andy? There's a snake in my boots. Hey, little guy. Are you in laser tag? Hmm. Hey, Chica, are you making Gregory pizza? Hey, little superstar, are you in the arcade? Oh, where could he be? I must have lost him. Oh, there you are, my little superstar. There's the Freddy animatronic. Well, at least what's left of him. Better call Gregory to get some more advice. Alfred, for some reason, the Joker has led me to a haunted pizzeria. I will need to call for backup. Oh no, not again! Huh? You're not Alfred. Ah, <sighs> let's try to get a hold of Gregory one more time. Cassie, can you hear me? I still need your help. Please, come help me. Greg, we found the Freddy animatronic. Do you have any advice for us? Remember, the animatronics have the same weaknesses that they do in all universes. That's what you said last time. I'm sorry, Cassie. That's the only advice I have for you. Please help me, I'm so scared. Oh, great. We're on our own again, little Gregory. Do you have any advice for me? <laughs> Good idea, Gregory. Let's give this shot. Hey, Freddy. Honestly, you look a lot better now without your head. In fact, you might even have a chance for Roxanne now. How about I just hand this to you? Oh, Monty. I'm so worried about Cass and little Gregory. Are you sure there's nothing we can do? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Why not? Wait, what? Oh, you mean how I said only a pure of heart child could help out Gregory? Yeah, that was a lie. Why didn't you tell us that in the first place? Honestly, I just don't like you, the little bean, or Cassie. Wow, Billy Eilish was right. When an ugly guy like you gets a girlfriend, you become a total jerk. Funny you should say that, Roxanne, because you and Billy Eilish have a lot in common too. Both of you are whiny little emo girls who use auto-tune and pretend you can sing. Ah! Freddy, come on. What's wrong, Roxanne? Monty's a total lying jerk, and we're going to save our superstars. There she is, Craig. The last animatronic. Roxy. I'd recognize her from anywhere. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I think I'll be okay. But I think I'm gonna handle this one alone, okay, Greg? Excuse me. Oh, Cassie. I know who you are. You, you remember who I am? How could I forget the most beautiful little girl I've ever seen? I'm, I'm so sorry, Roxy. And I know why you're here. It's to help out a friend. And I know what you must do. I'm so sorry. Oh, Cassie, no crying, no crying. You're so much stronger than that. Here, come here. Do you remember the first day we met? You were so sad. And I did everything I could to try to cheer you up. And you showed me what a strong young lady you really were. <laughs> I remember how happy you were to finally get that carrot cake. <sighs> well, better not prolong this any longer. Oh, Cassie, it's okay. And don't worry. And maybe in another lifetime, we can enjoy carrot cake one more time. Welcome to Ask the Animatronic, where you the fans get to ask us the animatronic questions. The first question is for me, and it's from Anime Boy. Anime Boy asks, Hey Freddy, why do you call Gregory the Little Bean? Well, the reason I call him my Little Bean is because he's so small and tiny, and calling him a baby gets annoying after a while, but he will always be my little superstar no matter what, even though he likes to torture me. Oh, likes to torture me a lot. The second question is from Semi Rage Org, and they have a question for Roxy. Mr. Org says, Hey Roxy, 
How do you stay so perfect? P.S. You're my favorite. Oh, thank you for noticing I'm perfect, but you're just stating the obvious. Anyway, how do I do that? Well, I wake up in the morning and go, whoo, thank goodness I'm Roxy and not any of the other animatronics, especially Monty. <laughs> then I get up, I brush my hair at least 5,000 times. Then I take a warm shower and clean off all the gunk and dirtiness I got from being around those noisy little kids. Not you, by the way. You're the good ones, the ones that love me. <laughs> then I pick up my favorite outfit and get ready to greet the world after putting up my favorite makeup. The final question is from David Low Level, and it's another one from Roxy. David asks, Hey Roxy, will you give Cassie your arm? Oh my goodness. Honestly, I would give anything for Cassie. That girl was so strong. It was so sad to see her that day when no one showed up to her birthday party. I was so happy I was able to show her how to do all these wonderful makeup tips. I think I love her like a daughter. In fact, she might be the one thing that I like more than myself. And it's for me. Question for Freddy. Why do you always roast Monty? I don't roast him all the time, and it's all in good fun. Besides, he always roasts me back too. You know, with me being the only single one in the whole pizza plex, he gets to roast me and call me a simp bear now. <laughs> the next question is from Raylan Schrager, and it's a question for me. The next question is for Ray. The next question is from Raylan Schrager, and is for Monty. Monty, if you had your choice, who would you rather marry, Roxanne or Chica? Well, let's see. I've always had a crush on Chica, even when she made fun of me. I've been dating Chica for a very long time. I can only picture myself with Chica. I even went on a trip to Disneyland with Chica with that annoying little bean. So the answer to that is anyone's guess. And the final question is from Cynthia Wharton, and she asks, when will Chapter 38 of the FNAF Security Breach comic come out? The honest answer to that is I don't know. Besides, you need... The honest answer is I don't have an on... To be honest, I don't know. Reason being is because Big Bear Dave is the one who made that comic. It's Unique Swan who makes that comic. Please check out Unique Swan's Instagram and show support and love to her. Would Chica rather have one cheese pizza or a pizza with all the toppings in the world on it? Hear me out on this one, okay? If I had infinite toppings on a pizza, I could literally have infinite pizzas. I'll explain. All the toppings would be accompanied by a pizza for each topping because technically another pizza on top of it is another topping. So I found a loophole, guys. Infinite pizzas! Infinite pizzas! If you have any more questions for the animatronics or me, leave it in the comments section. Or stick around and find out. Oh, look at the cute little baby. Night, night, little bean. <laughs> Gregory, what's wrong? Why are you crying? <laughs> oh, I know why you're crying. It's because the majority of the people who are watching this video aren't subscribed. So please, hit that subscribe button if you're still watching, and don't forget to like and share this video. Also, if you have an idea for any skits, please leave it in the comments section. Thanks again for watching, Bear Cubs.